got a chance to secure a semi-final place in the League Cup. And we've got what should be three points again in the league is Middlesbrough coming up as well today. Welcome back to the old 708 series with Man United. Let's go. What's happening folks and welcome back to the Manchester United 708 Custom Database series. That's a really long name but we're going with it. Welcome back guys. Don't forget to like button down below and check out the Let's Play channel and EFC channels down below. We are doing daily uploads on this series now in case you're wondering. The Bimec episode was one where I had one already pre-recorded for a while and so sat there waiting. And I thought it was released so I don't lose the whole footage. Um, so to focus on this series, we're going to do one, we're going to do one season with it um, and then... We'll see. If you guys prefer this, I'm going to do a video where you can, a, a post on the community section where you can give your thoughts, guys, what you prefer. Would you prefer just continue, just continue this at the end of the year to, or continue this to win Champions League or continue this uh, for one season then by a minute back and finish that one off and then come back, come back to this. All the things will be in the comments on that. So, or you can leave a comment on this video as well today. So, Preston in the League Cup. We've made rotational changes for this game today because we should be able to do that in this match. So Luis has playing. He's made just to rotate and get Tevez a complete rest. Now he's getting a rest. Skulls is, uh, so his skulls, whatever, is not fully fit, so he can't play it anyway. So Village uh, getting a complete rest. So basically, anyone who's basically not... Basically, everyone's getting the rest, basically. Um, it shouldn't be an issue in this match today. Saha is literally playing literally just so we can... Try and get him some um, generally generate some interest. I'm not, I'm not using him, I'd rather move him on and get some fees in for him as opposed to just not using him. Ben Foster's net today because <clears throat> Van der Sar, of course, got injured in the last episode. So we are playing out for the back still. We're going to see how he gets on with it today. It's an issue we've got with him, or he's potentially got an issue with him. So we're just going to see how that plays out against Preston today. It might not be much an issue because we've got a pro go dominate the ball. Here's Nani down the right hand side. Done well here. And in the box was Lou Saha. And Henderson with an easy catch. Not the Henderson, I don't think, obviously. But uh, promising start from Nani there. Long ball. O'Shea wins it. Finds Fletcher. Now Gary never brings it forward. Oh, you should do. Nani. Can't find a pass. He finds Rooney. Rooney. Louis Saha's in. Louis Saha! Oh. That should be a goal. At least on target. We'll talk about Dull game. Um, literally nothing happening so far. Uh, should be careful you diving in there, mate. You don't have to dive in that aggressively when there's no real danger at the time. Maybe now try and get the ball. Lusar's not offered much so far, but again, not surprised. Again, push on the ball, lads. That's too easy. This could be a goal, this. Again, push on the ball or watch the runner. It's one of the two. But we haven't seen Foster play out from the back yet, so let's need to see how he does. Oh, he's thrown out. Okay, fair enough. PK, don't take too long with it. Passing options are on. Play one, pick one, and decide and pick one. I think a lot of times this game is just the the the, the, the issue with the passing out from back is that players just take too long. Don't shoot. That needs to be patching as well for the FM25. Get thoughtful about shooting every time they get half a chance. Corner kick, curled in. Foster comes out, good catch. Right then, that can't be the highlight. Hurry up, Foster. Don't take too long. Again, taking too long with the throw. You can just throw it over them to someone making a forward run. But I think, I think they take they hesitate too much and then they just end up doing this. Say passes all the time. Pay a ball forward. Great ball. Rooney. Can I find a cross? Find Anderson. Now, Nani. Yeah, we need to make changes at half time because I, I, I want to rotate, but I also want to win this game. And these guys aren't cutting it. This is why I don't like this rotation much in this team because I rotate my squad and my players don't perform. Luis Saha. Yeah, I need to rotate. I want to get this game won. I don't want to be making Preston have half a chance in this game. And too many players are not really doing it in this first half. If we get a goal, I'll not all for half time, I'll keep it as it is. But we, if we don't score for half time, I'm going to make some changes probably. Ball in the box. Luis Saha's in there. Fletcher being in control. In the penalty he goes. Down Fletcher. That's a penalty shout there, but not given. Anderson! Again, they're just picking the wrong decision out. They're not taking, they're just not taking touch when they could take touch or they're. Do the opposite what they should do, basically. Dominating possession. Far from pleased. Uh, I'm going to bring Schneider on for Anderson. And I'm going to bring Ronaldo on for Nani. That's all I'm going to change. Just a bit more attacking threat in those two positions. Uh, Saha's not done that much, but it is what it is. Um, but there's the, the time for rotating and keeping players in. And there's the time for, like... Why didn't... And there's the time for... Um, Whatever, there's a time for rotation, there's a time for taking the pace, and it's not those times. I need to get the win. Um, Ronaldo, Schneider, Schwester, now Rooney. Rooney's been really poor on the left hand side today. 
does that. I'm sure he'll do something soon. He's got the quality to do it. Rooney, Carrick in the box. Edge of the box to Fletcher. One of you. So you're, you're both Fletcher. They're going to run towards it. I feel like times they, just, they don't want to make the extra run. And that's the issue. Gary Neville. Fletcher in the box. They saw her. There we go. I didn't want to take him off. Um, and he's got the goal. And that might help us sell him in January, potentially. We get the lead, finally. I would say I would say it's been coming, but it hasn't really been coming, honestly. It's been... I think we've been most likely to score, if anybody, but we've not really been hammering the door down. Good boy to lose Saha. Free header. There we go. 1-0. And it might help us sell him. Um, but at least he scored a goal for his own confidence. Shea. Sylvester. Carrick. Get out of his way. Right. You three, you're too close. Spread into the... Into the Carrick should be over there. And Fletcher will be down here. They're too close together in those areas when they're trying to pass through. And it's like, well, I can't pass you there because you're marked. Now they'll give it to him. Go on, Ronaldo. Ah, poor pass. Push on the ball. Well done, Fletcher. Great work rate. Not, not, not surprised, though. Again, don't need to go backwards with it. You can go forwards down the line yourself. I feel like... The, 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 no, don't do this. Forward over the top. Over the top. Oh, why? Don't... There we go. Rooney in the box. Is it across to Ronaldo too? No, there we go. Just at times they they, they, they they just don't want to give the ball with. Oh, I'm going to play a safe pass and look look, look good in my passing stats. Just play the ball forward, mate, and just be more aggressive with it. You don't have to, like here, you don't need to go here backwards here or sideways. You can play the ball you played. And look, oh, it was one pass. So he sees the ball. Brave, early ball. Rooney, like I said, he's got the quality in that position to do something. Now he's completely unmarked. 2-0. Like I said, it's getting that balance between, yes, keep the possession, but you can be creative and be aggressive with your with your play. You don't have to just like, oh, I can't get the ball away. No, you can get the ball away in the attempt to get a good ball down the line to somebody, but you don't have to just be all just safe with it. Now, Foster's pen from the back's been okay so far today, and the fact it's got a highlight here is interesting. Ronaldo, Fletcher, Schneider. Suddenly, two players on the bench, off the bench, and suddenly, look, 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 look how dangerous we look now, Ronaldo. But on the box towards Rooney. Ronaldo's in there, and Rooney's in there for free. There we go. Always been two changes. Uh, Schneider on the Ronaldo one, and all of a sudden we see the, the surge. Rooney's got a bit of a fitness issue now, so we're going to take him off. I'm going to bring on Jisung Park. Um, it's 3-0. I can, I can rotate that. Um, Neville on the right-hand side does really well. Um, good ball in the box. Then Ronaldo just works harder and gets it first. Rooney more alert, flicks it on. And there we go. Rooney, it feels like forever since Rooney scored a goal, but it's probably not that long. But 3-0 against Preston, that's probably enough to get the game over now. So with this in mind again, we're going to make changes wherever we can, really, just to get uh, players off. I'm going to... Um, no one else really. Guy never could come off, I suppose. Oh, no. I need to, I need to break completely, doesn't it? So, yeah. We've done what we wanted, really. We've taken the squad. I've got a couple I didn't want to bring on, but we've got the win anyway. So, late on the game now, it looks like it's going to be a clean sheet. Base is going. Ball on the box towards PK. Brings it down. Finds Gary Neville. Oh, yeah. This is close. I think he's offside. Gary Neville has scored. I think he said three goals. Then. It might be four. Um, is he onside, Gary Neville, here? He is. How has Gary Neville got three or four goals in this in this um, series? I don't understand it. I mean, this is a good finish. I don't care what. This is a good finish. Just side foots it. First time into the far post. That's a really good finish. Was it close to me offside or was it way on? It's close, isn't it? Look at that. First time, side foot, it's a bit of whip on it. And it's 4 0 against Preston. And we will show the cup draw for the semi final. And that's going to be full time. Wow, a lot of our time. I'm guessing for that injury there, I'm assuming. Can we, can we get a late goal? I'll take 4 0, honestly. At full time. Manchester United 4, Preston North End 0. I'm okay with that. Very good result for us here. Um, Ideally, not bring Ronaldo and Schneider on, but I wasn't keen on like letting it go much longer. I wanted to make sure I got the win. But Ronaldo and Schneider were okay for 45 minutes, so I didn't want them to like. I didn't want to risk losing the tie or making it awkward. I just wanted to get the win. Once we got, once we got, we might we might still win the game anyway, honestly. Um, but it is what it is. It is what it is. And I'm getting a lot of this lagging thing here in the menu, so um, that's fine. Uh, just when you know we saw it there when we were doing box up, it just kind of lagged a little bit to go up. I don't know if that's a normal thing or not, but it is, it is what it is. Right then, so how many goals have Gary Neville got this season? He's got three goals, one assist. That's impressive. Right then, so I don't know when the cup draw actually takes place. I I, I checked. 
Is it relatively soon? It's so quick that men, that, that processing, I can't read it. Well, here's Lam. Deal's done for, for Lam. We know that was happening anyway. So let's have a look at the um, schedule for this. Because we can look at it on here, can't we? And see when the draw will take place. Uh, 22nd. And our next game is on the 23rd. So back for the quick draw. So guys, same final draw here. Um, I'm not sure who else is in this in this draw. So I'll show all the teams. Okay, we should be getting through this tie, uh, regardless who we're playing. But we are going to show both games in this semi-final, of course, in this League Cup. Because it makes sense, because I want to, basically. So, uh, who do we want? Uh, Bolton would be kind of cool. Um, but anyway, let's see what we get. Um, I don't really have a, I don't really have a team I want to avoid, honestly, um, out, of, out, of, out of them all. So, why should you get Bolton? Because my predictions usually are quite good at getting these right, usually. A lot of times I get this right. Um, granted, it's a bit easier on this occasion because there's only three teams it can be, so there's a bit better chance. But yeah, Bolton. So let's see when the draw is going to take, when the ties take place, because that will dictate episodes we do. So we're doing those for the next episode. Then one, two, three, and then I think we literally do those games off camera against Birmingham, Fulham, and Wigan, and then come back for Bristol City and Bolton, and then see where we're at. And then we'll probably do um, where Chelsea in the league. Chelsea quite high. So the, I think the episode has been quite kind. We do Bristol City and Bolton next episode. Then do Bolton and Chelsea next episode. And then we'll probably come back for Tottenham and Leon after that. But then we'll see where things go from there. But we'll pencil in these. That episode, next episode is going to be Bristol City and Bolton and go from there. Well, back from Millsborough in well, one second for you. Bit of news. Um, Sylvester signed a new contract. Just... Sorry, backup player. Didn't really want to like lose him. He's not terrible physically. He's still got the stats to do what I want him to do. Good defense to centre back and left back as far as makes sense to keep him. Louis Saha wants to discuss his meeting. Um, you're not going to play, mate. Um, that's the honest answer. Um, No, I just don't have you in. I I don't have you in my plans, honestly. Um, I'm trying to sell him, um, but we'll just try and get him out of the club. I just don't have him in my plans in this team, honestly. Um, so obviously this team's gonna be very different to what I. Actually, before I do this, let's make sure I, I get the main team up. It essentially is that, um, but it's actually how argues it plays there. So Everett's not fit, so we'll put Sylvester in there. Rio's not fit, so we'll put in um, Wes Brown. PK on there, and then Ev Everett out there. So everyone else is basically fit, aren't they? Apart from, obviously, the obvious goalkeeping situation that we have. And then Guy Neville, can he play? He kind of has to. I mean, we could play PK. Of PK stats wise, yeah, I'm gonna give PK another run out. Um, I just want to try and rest where I can. Where's Brown? Can there you go? Yeah, so it's not ideal. You can see why I'm getting the right back in. Um, <laughs> um, which is obviously gonna be Philip Lamb. He might starve a guy level to be fair. Uh, but Middlesbrough, we need to win this game. We the kind of game we need to just go there, get the win. The form is not great. Doesn't matter. Um, FM for me, the form doesn't really matter. When it comes to um, my teams, I could teams lost five games in a row, four nil, and they'll come in and keep a clean sheet and score six. This is just the way it goes for me. Um, anyway, Millsbury, let's see what happens. Swisher, ah, gone for it. I thought we were getting a really early goal there. Still a highlight for this. Giggs, Hargreaves, in the penalty goes. Aaron Hargreaves, ah, he's just trying to. Do something there. We didn't really. I'm not sure what he was trying to do. Where's Brown? Ronaldo. Where's Brown? Kills in far post. There's Giggs. Let's it run. Falls to Giggs again at the far post. Can he cross it? And he can. Towards Ronaldo. Cleared again. Where's Brown? Back to Ronaldo. Turns. Finds Giggs. 1 0. He just felt like it was recycling it, recycling it, recycling it. Went where? 1 minute and 30 seconds. Well, 27 actually, I think it was. And um, when it went out to the back of the net. Manchester United 1, Millsburg 0. And this is. This feel like. A series of really bad crosses that we kept alive. Um, and then, obviously, Ronaldo again heavily involved. Lays it to Ryan Giggs. First time shot with his left foot. Makes it 1-0. Early goal. You love to see it. Well done, Giggsy. Thank you for the goal. And let's kick on. Where's Brown? The key thing in this game is to get an early goal. 
and then get a second one if you possibly can to, to, to penalty. I say key moment is to get the second goal after the first to really stamp your, stamp your authority on it. Now, this is an interesting call because I think this is the penalty. Tevez is down injured, but who's going to take a penalty? It should be Ronaldo, I think. Um, who's taking the penalty? Is Ronaldo? Yeah, I'm not, I've, I've set these, but I'm not sure what the order is. So here's Ronaldo stepping up with the penalty, make it 2 0 here against Middlesbrough, and he does against Schwarzer. Middlesbrough 0, Manchester United 2, Ronaldo with 15th goal of the season, his 50th goal for the club in total, obviously in his database. Um, well done, Ronaldo, 2 0. That's the big, that's the, that's the goal I wanted to see. Second goal, right. Now I want to see a professional performance. A third goal now would be. Uh, would be delightful, wouldn't it? Just to really stamp, stamp down the authority on the match. And maybe we can actually relax a bit. Ronaldo in the penalty area. Doing well here. Find Schneider to this. Oh, I just can't find the pass. I think he wanted to shoot, but then he kind of got boxed out of it. Find Giggs with a corner kick. Should be Giggs anyway. Curls it in. There's Vidic! There's the third. What are they giving here? Offside. Uh, I didn't see what PK was, so I don't know. Please give this goal. I'm not sure PK was stood. Right, what? Where was he stood? Ah, fair enough. He's right in front of the keeper's eye line. Yeah, fair enough. That's fair enough. Um, I didn't, I didn't see where PK was. Half time, comfortable and enjoyable. You know, not been amazing. We've done. We've been professional. We've not let them back into the game in any sense of thought. Anyway, 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 I'm gonna say don't get complacent. We were. An inch away from getting the third goal if PK had not run and been caught offside and it'd been 3 0 and probably definitely game over. But yeah, 2 0. Keep it going. Can't get a third goal. Ball in the box. Was Brown's in this? Cleared his score through the box. He's got time to be in some control. Finish to the extra. Don't know who he's trying to pick out there. And there's a break on here now. But again, look at the work rate. Just, they were they're just working hard to get the ball back. Skulls. Good ball. Ronaldo's in. Cristiano Ronaldo! I didn't think he can go. I think it would have been a goal if keeper hadn't got a hand to it. The keeper saved it. I thought that was a goal. I was waiting for the net to bulge. Uh, Giggs with a corner kick. Curls in the penalty area. Piquet was in there for that. Ronaldo wings it back to Giggs. Giggs. Cuts inside. Shoot somebody. Schneider. Vestra, not you. <laughs> and here, second I said, someone shoot. I knew Mikel would hear me. Okay, make some changes now. Anderson, come on for Wesley Schneider. We'll get Vestra off for John O'Shea. We'll get Wes Brown off for Gary Neville. Uh, actually, no, Ganel needs a rest completed, didn't they? So, but where's Brown you playing? Um, Fletcher on for Hargreaves, Carrick on for Skulls, Deason Park on for Giggs if I can. There we go. Just again, fresh legs where we can. It's 2 0. We should be okay, he says. Throw in here for Young. Don't see the goal now. That'd be very annoying because this game's been dead for most of the match. Don't be stupid now. Deason Park. Don't know why you're doing that, mate. Hold the ball and shield it. and Well done. Poor pass. Brings it back, though. Jason Park can't find a pass to somebody here. He's found Ronaldo, who's in on goal. Christian Ronaldo! And he's missed another one. That is surprising. But miss it at 2 0 no, with, with two minutes, three minutes to go. Man, miss it 0 no, 0 no, with a minute to go when we need a winner. But you know what? This is what I would call the definition of professional performance. 2 0 up, controlled the game, didn't give him a chance, didn't really break a sweat. Yeah, 30, 20 shots on goal, 13 on target, 3.17 XG. I'm okay with it. It's a good performance. It's just come here, get the win. Bye-bye, see you later. And actually, historically, if you look at the back of the Premier League, this is, a tough, this is a tough game for United in the past. Always an interesting game. And with results elsewhere not going our way, it was important to get that win. We're still six points clear at the top with a massive superior goal difference. So I'm very pleased. Oh, I tell you what we could do. I just fought somebody. Ah, uh, no, not really justified. I think I just think I dig dig off. Is is Ron still playing? I'm still thinking of fully players that can begin to bring back in. Oh, he is. But he's 30, he, he be 32. He be old. Who, who wants to sign him? I just want to sign him. I still got former players United had that we could bring in. Maybe that could be really really cool. Well, have they changed this? Has he changed this for former players? I mean, he's still got Van Persie. People in here. It was like. Not joined yet. Um, I'm trying to think of players maybe we could bring in. For Neville could be one we could try and get. I'm trying to think of players we could maybe go for. That would be kind of interesting. Um, former players or current players. No one really 
stands out as somebody I could maybe go and get or be interested in getting. De Gea is still an option. Um, but, but yeah, anyway. So, really good results. Really pleased with that. So, guys, honestly, let me know in the comments what you think about this. I mean, I prefer one series at a time. It's easy to focus on it and go from there. And it makes things easier in my head to do know what I need to record and when to record it. Um, and do you want me to continue this to win Champions League with Manchester United and that will be the series when it ends? Or shall we do one season and try and finish Bayern Munich? i guessing people watching this are my United fans who want to see win Champions League. And I'm fine with that, of course. I'm okay with it. Um, the We'll see. Uh, it means if I do do one series, it will be daily uploads. Um, so tomorrow we another upload with this epic, with this series. So, like I said for the um, schedule, I've got look at that green by the way. Only two defeats all season. That's good even for me. Uh, well, it is good for me. Sorry. So in this episode, we're going to come back for Bristol City and Bolton in the FA Cup and League Cup. So a bit different than what we've been doing recently, which has been a lot of Champions League and League games. A bit of FA Cup action there. Could be could there be a shock? Hopefully not. Um, Birmingham, Fulham, Wigan off camera, and Bristol City and Bolton. And then we'll come back for probably um, Bolton and Chelsea after that. And then we'll see where things are and what have you. Actually, as soon as we get to the final, which is a big if, um, let's have a look when the final takes place, if we do get to the final, of course. So the final takes place in February 25th. So when's that going to be? February 25th. Right, so that's going to be right there, isn't it? So it just get it, that's going to be a line coming its own if we get there, of course. Big if. Um, Bolton, where they in the table? 17. We should beat them. Ideally, what you want to do is to blitz these guys like 4-5-0 at Old Trafford. Full team out for it. Because I will I'll put second string out against Bristol City and full team out against Bolton. Blitz them at Old Trafford in the first leg. Then I can rotate for that game there. And it gives me a chance to rotate a bit more. And then you will probably see next episode a new signing. Or maybe two new signings, actually, because we're going to have... Um, Actually, we've got Fabio Silva and Raphael both coming in as well. I doubt I'm going to play either of those in this. Um, but Philip Lam and David Silva are definitely possibilities that they'll they will play in in that in that in, in that um, in that episode. Um, you see new some, some new signings, so that's something to look forward to. So yeah, guys, if you have enjoyed the episode, I hope you have it. Like button down below. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to check out the Let's Play channel and the EFT channel down below. But until next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.